prisons play a crucial role in society by serving as institutions for punishment and rehabilitation. However, some prisons have gained notoriety for their extreme cruelty, harsh conditions and inhumane treatment of inmates. In this video, we will explore the history, conditions and treatment of prisoners in the 10 most notorious and cruel prisons around the world. 1. Alcatraz Federal Penitentiary, United States Alcatraz, located on an isolated island in San Francisco Bay, operated as a maximum security prison from 1934 to 1963. Known as The Rock, it housed some of the America's most notorious criminals. Prisoners at Alcatraz were subjected to strict discipline, a rigid daily routine and extensive periods of solitary confinement. The prison's remote location and treacherous waters made escape nearly impossible. The security measures at Alcatraz included armed guards, guard towers, constant surveillance and multiple layers of barriers contributing to its reputation as an impenetrable fortress. One of the most famous and dangerous inmates of Alcatraz was Al Capone. Capone was a notorious gangster and the leader of the Chicago outfit during the Prohibition era. Known for his involvement in organized crime and ruthless methods, he was convicted of tax evasion and sentenced to prison. His incarceration in Alcatraz cemented the prison's reputation as a place for the country's most dangerous criminals. Other notable prisoners include Robert Strout, known as the Birdman of Alcatraz, who gained notoriety for his study of birds while serving time for murder. Alcatraz is renowned for its reputation as an inescapable prison. Although many inmates attempted to escape, no successful escapes were recorded. The most famous escaped attempt occurred in 1962, when three inmates, Frank Morris and brothers John and Clarence Engling, used homemade tools to chisel away at the walls of their cells and created a makeshift raft to escape through a ventilation shaft. Despite an extensive manhunt and investigations, no conclusive evidence of their survival or escape was found. 2. La Sainte Prison, France Situated in Paris, La Sainte Prison has a long and troubled history. Dating back to the 19th century, it has been plagued by chronic overcrowding and deplorable living conditions. Inmates are subjected to limited contact with the outside world, strict discipline and frequent incidents of violence. Lissant has housed notorious criminals and political prisoners alike. The prison's security system features high walls, surveillance cameras and armed guards to deter escape attempts. Lissant prison has housed several high-profile prisoners including Jacques Mesrin. Mesrin was a notorious French criminal, known as public enemy number one. He carried out a series of daring robberies, kidnappings and murders during the 1960s and 1970s. Mesrin's reputation as a charismatic and fearless criminal made him a symbol of criminality in France. He was eventually arrested and imprisoned in La Sainte where he planned a daring escape in 1978, but was recaptured. Le Sainte Prison has had several escaped attempts throughout its history. One notable escape occurred in 1986, when Michel Vaujot, a French criminal, hijacked a helicopter and landed it in the prison courtyard. He then used explosives to free his wife, who was serving a sentence for attempted murder. The escape sparked a nationwide manhunt, but both Bajou and his wife were eventually apprehended. 3. Bang Wong Central Prison, Thailand 
Meng Wong, also known as the Bangkok Hilton, is notorious for its harsh conditions and strict discipline. Inmates are shackled at all times, even during sleep, and live in crowded and unsanitary cells. The prison has a significant issue with overcrowding, and death row holds prisoners awaiting execution. Notable inmates include those convicted of drug trafficking and murder. Bank Wong's security system includes surveillance cameras, armed guards and high walls to maintain control over the inmate population. Bank Wong has housed numerous dangerous criminals, including drug traffickers and murderers. One notable inmate was Shalem Yubamrung, a former Thai police officer and politician. Yubamrung was convicted of multiple crimes, including drug trafficking and murder. His status as a former law enforcement officer and his involvement in organized crime made him a high-profile inmate within Bank Wong. Bank Wong has witnessed several escaped attempts, but they have generally been unsuccessful due to the prison's high security measures. In 1996, three inmates managed to escape by digging a tunnel from their cell to the outside. However, they were quickly captured by authorities. The prison's stringent security systems and vigilant staff have made successful escapes rare. 4. Carandero Penitentiary, Brazil Once the largest prison in Latin America, Carandero gained infamy for its extreme violence and inhumane conditions. Overcrowding, limited medical care and systemic corruption plagued the facility. In 1992, a brutal massacre occurred, resulting in the death of 111 inmates. Carandero was eventually closed in 2002 due to its notorious reputation. The prison employed armed guards, multiple layers of fences, and strict surveillance as part of its security system. Carandero housed a significant number of dangerous criminals during its operation. One of the most notorious inmates was Marcus Willens Herbus Camancho, also known as Marcola. Marcola was the leader of the notorious criminal organization Primero Comando de Capital, PCC, in Brazil. He was involved in drug trafficking, arms smuggling and organized crime. Marcola's influence and control extended even within the prison walls, where he continued to operate and plan criminal activities. Carandiro experienced a major prison riot in 1992, which resulted in the death of over 100 inmates. During the chaos of the riot, a few prisoners managed to escape. However, the majority were quickly recaptured or killed by law enforcement. Carandiro's massive size and overcrowded conditions made it challenging for inmates to navigate and escape undetected. 5. Tedmore Military Prison, Syria Tedmore, located in the heart of the Syrian desert, served as a symbol of oppression and torture under the regime of Bashar al-Assad. The prison was notorious for its brutal interrogation methods and widespread human rights abuses. Countless atrocities occurred within its walls, and in 1980, a massacre led to the death of an estimated 1,000 prisoners. Although Tadmor was closed in 2001, it was reopened in 2015 under new management. The prison security system consists of armed guards, high walls and strict control over inmate movements. Tadmor military prison held various political prisoners and dissidents under the regime of Bashar al-Assad. One of the most famous inmates was Riyad Saif, a Syrian opposition leader and pro-democracy activist. Saif was arrested and imprisoned for his involvement in advocating for political reforms in Syria. His imprisonment and subsequent treatment in Tadmor became a symbol of the oppressive regime's crackdown on dissent. Tedmore military prison has been the site of several notorious mass escapes. In 2015, 
During the Syrian civil war, the Islamic State of Iraq and the Levant ISIS, attacked the prison and successfully freed hundreds of inmates, many of whom were extremists or members of militant groups. The prison security was severely compromised during the conflict, leading to widespread chaos and prisoner releases. 6. Buterka Prison, Russia Buterka Prison, established in Moscow in 1777, has a long and notorious history. Overcrowding, disease and violence have plagued the facility for centuries. The prison has been used to incarcerate political dissidents and notorious criminals. Buterka housed numerous prominent political prisoners, including writer Alexander Solzhenitsyn and political activist Mikhail Khodorkovsky. The security measures at Buterka include surveillance cameras, armed guards and strict control over inmate movements. Buterka prison has held various dangerous criminals throughout its history. One of the most notorious prisoners was Alexander Solzhenitsyn, a renowned Russian writer and Nobel laureate. Solzhenitsyn was imprisoned for his critical writings of the Soviet Union and spent several years in Buterka and other Soviet labor camps. His experience in prison influenced his literary works, including his famous novel One Day in the Life of Ivan Denisovich, which shed light on the harsh conditions and brutality of the Soviet prison system. Buterka prison has witnessed a few escaped attempts throughout its history, but successful escapes have been rare. In 1986, three inmates managed to escape by overpowering a guard and scaling the prison walls. However, they were eventually apprehended by law enforcement. The prison's high security measures and constant monitoring make it challenging for the inmates to escape undetected. 7. San Juan de Lurgancho, Peru San Juan de Lurgancho, situated in Lima, is one of the most overcrowded and dangerous prison in South America. Originally designed to accommodate 2,500 inmates, it now holds over 9,000. Gang violence, drug trafficking and extortion are prevalent within its walls. Despite efforts to improve conditions, the prison remains notorious for its brutally and inadequate facilities. The security system at San Juan de Lurgancho includes armed guards, surveillance cameras and restricted inmate movements. San Juan de Lurgancho has housed notorious criminals and members of powerful criminal organizations. One of the most dangerous inmates was Abimael Guzman, the founder and leader of the Shining Path, a Maoist insurgent group in Peru. Guzman orchestrated numerous acts of terrorism, including bombings, assassinations and massacres during the 1980s and 1990s. His imprisonment in San Juan de Durigancho marked a significant blow to the Shining Path insurgency. San Juan de Durigancho has experienced occasional escaped attempts, but most have been unsuccessful. In 2012, a group of inmates managed to escape by digging a tunnel from their cell to the prison's outer wall. However, the majority of escapees were quickly recaptured. The prison has since implemented stricter security measures to prevent further escapes. 8. Gitarama Central Prison, Rwanda Gitarama gained notoriety after the Rwandan genocide in 1984. The prison was marked by extreme overcrowding, malnutrition and disease. It witnessed widespread violence, human rights abuses and systemic cruelty. The International Criminal Tribunal for Rwanda classified Gitarama as the site of the systematic and widespread human rights violations. The prison's security system comprised armed guards, restricted inmate movements and multiple layers of barriers. Gitarama prison held several individuals involved in the Rwandan genocide of 1984. One of the most infamous inmates 
was Felician Kabuga, who played a significant role in finding and organizing the genocide. Kabuga was a wealthy businessman who allegedly financed and supported extremist Hutu groups. After years of evading capture, he was arrested in 2020 and extradited to the International Residual Mechanism for Criminal Tribunals to face charges for his role in the genocide. Jitorama prison witnessed a mass escape during the Rwandan genocide of 1994. Inmates, including many convicted of genocide-related crimes, overwhelmed the guards and broke out of the facility. The chaos and breakdown of security during the genocide facilitated the escape. However, the majority of escapees were eventually captured or killed during subsequent military operations. 9. Black Beach Prison, Equatorial Guinea Situated on the island of Bioko, Black Beach Prison is known for its extreme brutality and disregard for human rights. Inmates endure appalling living conditions, including severe overcrowding, limited access to healthcare and physical and psychological abuse. The prison primarily houses political prisoners and is notorious for its secretive and oppressive atmosphere. The security measures at Black Beach Prison involve armed guards, high walls and tight control of the inmate movements. Black Beach Prison has housed political prisoners and individuals, considered threats to the regime. One notable inmate was Severo Moto, an opposition leader and vocal critic of the government of Equatorial Guinea. Moto was arrested and imprisoned for his political activities and outspoken stance against the ruling regime. His imprisonment in Black Beach Prison highlighted the government's repression of political dissent. Black Beach Prison has not reported any successful escape in recent history. The prison is known for its strict security measures and the limited opportunities for inmates to organize escaped attempts. The high level of surveillance and restricted movement make it difficult for prisoners to devise successful escape plans. 10. Polycharkli Prison, Afghanistan Originally built to accommodate 5,000 inmates, Pulicharki gained notoriety during the Soviet occupation and subsequent conflicts in Afghanistan. The prison has been associated with torture, ill treatment, and extrajudicial killings. Overcrowding, lack of sanitation, and limited medical care have resulted in dire conditions. Notable prisoners at Pulicharki include Taliban members and political dissidents. The prison's security system includes armed guards, high walls and strict control over inmate movements. Pulicharki prison has held dangerous criminals and individuals associated with militant groups in Afghanistan. One of the notable inmates was Anwar al-Haq Mujahid, a senior member of the Taliban. Mujahid was known for his involvement in planning and executing attacks against Afghan and international forces. His presence in Pulicharki underscored the ongoing challenges of dealing with extremist elements within the country. Pulicharki prison has experienced occasional escaped attempts. In 2011, nearly 500 inmates escaped during a coordinated attack on the facility by the Taliban. The attack involved a suicide card bomb and a subsequent assault by armed militants. The large number of escapes highlighted the vulnerability of the prison's security systems during times of conflict and instability. One of the most secure and modern prisons in the United States is the United States Penitentiary Administrative Maximum Facility, commonly known as ADX Florence or simply Supermax. Located in Florence, Colorado, ADX Florence is a maximum security tendril prison designed to house the most dangerous and high-profile inmates in the country. Here are some key features that make ADX Florence one of the most secure and technologically advanced prisons in the USA. 1. Physical design. ADX Florence was built with robust architectural features 
aimed at maximizing security. The prison consists of multiple secure housing units, each with individual cells made of poured concrete and solid steel doors. The cells are equipped with minimal amenities to prevent prisoners from hiding contraband or creating potential security risks. 2. Controlled movement Inmates at ADX Florence have limited mobility within the facility. They spend the majority of their time in the cells, typically for 23 hours a day. When they are allowed out, they are individually escorted by correctional officers and subjected to strict monitoring and surveillance. 3. Technological surveillance ADX Florence employs a sophisticated network of security cameras, motion sensors and alarm systems throughout the facility. These surveillance systems continuously monitor inmates' activities, common areas and restricted areas, ensuring that any unusual behavior or security breaches are detected promptly. 4. Communication monitoring In order to prevent unauthorized communication and potential criminal activities, ADX Florence strictly monitors inmate communication. All phone calls, mail and visits are closely scrutinized and often subject to recording or interception. Inmates have limited access to the outside world, and all communication is heavily regulated and monitored. 5. Staffing and Training ADX Florence has a highly trained and experienced staff that is dedicated to maintaining the prison security. Correctional officers receive extensive training in security protocols, crisis management and the handling of high-risk inmates. The staff is equipped with statue-of-the-art security equipment and is prepared to respond quickly to any potential threats or emergencies. 6. Remote operations some areas of ADX Florence are remotely operated, allowing staff to control certain functions of the prison from secure control rooms. This feature minimizes direct inmate staff interactions and reduces the risk of physical confrontations. 7. Perimeter security ADX Florence has a formidable perimeter security system designed to deter and prevent escapes. The prison is surrounded by multiple layers of reinforced fencing, detection systems and armed patrols. The remote location of the facility further enhances security by providing natural barriers and limiting access to the prison grounds. ADX Florence's reputation as a supermax facility stems from its exceptional security measures and its ability to effectively isolate and control high-risk inmates. It is worth noting that while the prison is designed to ensure the safety of both staff and inmates, concerns have been raised about the long-term effects of prolonged isolation on prisoners' mental health. The 10 prisons discussed in this article represent some of the most cruel and notorious correctional facilities worldwide. From the isolated fortress of Alcatraz to the oppressive confines of Tedmore military prison, these institutions have left an inedible mark on the history of incarceration. The severe conditions and inhumane treatment experienced by prisoners in these facilities underscore the urgent need for prison reform and the protection of human rights. By shedding light on these dark chapters of imprisonment, we can strive for a more just and humane correctional system that upholds the dignity and well-being of all individuals, even those convicted of crimes.